Hi, this is Julian Valderrama. I'm the author of Blueprint for Immortality, the Quantum Code for Life Secrets to Success. Life is a game. The Quantum Code for Life's Principles for Success. The name of this riff is title and consider. Transformation only happens in response to a need, not a desire. Let me repeat that again. Transformation or change what you want to happen only happens in response to a need, not a desire. People observe pain, suffering, and chaos, but no real change takes place in their life unless they are desperate of such change themselves. Patterns of thinking and action become cemented via magnetic rhythm. Most just don't see how consequences reflect their quality of life. Yes, the quality of your philosophy about life will determine the quality of your life. It is law. Your inability to change because you are comfortable with the little bit of pain and discomfort will eventually become your biggest downfall. Einstein said that your current problems cannot be solved with the same thinking patterns that created them. And this is worth repeating. Einstein said that your current problems, our current problems, cannot be solved with the same thinking patterns that created them. And Nikola Tesla called them inoxorable agents that prevent a mass from changing. The problem is, is that all our systems of thought have taught you to give your power away. It seems at some point We were a civilization that had fully integrated full responsibility and personal integrity with the ramifications of quantum mechanics and the mind. Someone felt threatened and subdued a civilization that had evolved enough to threaten such power. It's obvious because all systems of thought currently in place Demand that you give up your thinking ability and project all your life force to systems that promise you the world. And again, that's worth repeating. Pay close attention. It is obvious because all systems of thought currently in place demand that you give up your thinking ability and to project all your life force to systems that promise you the world. They have proven to only give you pain and suffering. In turn, they blame you and say that it is you who is wrong for making obvious observations. The only ones that work are the ones that remind you that the power is in you, not outside of you. These systems will always be demonized and campaigns of propaganda will always come out to crush their efforts to remind you of who you really are. Still, it may mean that you will not wake up to what you can do until you reach mass critical failure. This will happen individually and collectively. But such extreme circumstances are not necessary. Do not wait until you are dealing with the literal or figurative world war to make the changes necessary. Let me give you some examples. If you always fear unfaithfulness from a partner, you will always attempt to fill your void with unending confirmation and validation. 
you will confuse being in love with loving the self through others. You will always crave a fix. And this principle applies to your relationships with money, work, and even your health. Your need for others becomes a business transaction where you feel inadequate and resentful the second you don't receive what you think you need from the other. You will always feel like a victim. You must learn to trust others because you don't have to. And let me repeat that again. You must learn to trust others because you don't have to. Write that down. Put it somewhere where you can see it everywhere. Put it on a, a board. Put it in front of your computer where you always see it. You must learn to trust others because you don't have to. Because you know that even if you experience the worst case scenario of your fears, you know you will be just fine. Ironically, it is only in this state where you can prove to show real unconditional love. Life then shifts to give you what you want unconditionally. Okay, this is the end of this riff. I highly suggest, if you have not already done so, to support this channel by buying this book. Life is a Game, the Quantum Code for Life's Principles for Success, and my previous volume, Blueprint for Immortality, the Quantum Code for Life's Secrets to Success. Also, go ahead and put a like on this video if you feel it is valuable. Also, share this with loved ones, friends, and this will help raise awareness of this kind of life-changing knowledge. So consider that because what you do for others, you do for yourself. What you fail to do for others, you also fail to do for yourself. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already done so. And also go ahead and put a comment below if you feel you have any questions, comments, or observations. I certainly love to read that from you. Let me know what did you like best and what you got out of it of what you heard today. And don't forget, life is a game and this is the quantum code for life's principles for success.